Oh, and welcome back, folks. Uh, what did we do last time? We uh, took out that convoy and unlocked the silent Makarov, as well as two other pistols, I think. Probably the Star 45 and um, the flare pistol, maybe? I don't know. I've never really used the flare pistol. I think I used it like once or twice. It's not that. It's not that useful. It really. It basically what it does. I think um, is that it lets you set something on fire from a distance, basically. So you shoot the flare, and let's say you wanted to shoot some. You want to set some grass on fire that's uh, quite a distance away. Just yeah, you just do that. Um, it's really not. Uh, at least in my experience, I haven't found any sort of real use for it or practical ac application. How many diamonds do I have? I can't, uh, three, I have three diamonds ago. Let's see, so, I kind of, so I, I want to use the double barrel shotgun. I like the pistol and everything, but I just sort of want to use it just, just because, so. We'll go ahead and use that. Um, what else? I should probably replace this. Should I go with the silent, uh, nah, nah, we'll leave that. I don't know if I'll ever use the silent shotgun, but uh, you know, you know, time will tell. Anyway, ah, uh, so I need—I'm short like one diamond, I think, to buy the silent Makarov, or is it six diamonds? I don't remember. Yeah, I think it was six diamonds, so I'm short. Um, three diamonds. Maybe I can just drive around and look for a, uh, you know, suitcases, briefcases. I keep calling it suitcases again. Damn it. Um, where would I do that? Would be the best place to do that, actually. Should I just drive this way? I don't know. I don't want to like go out of my way to do like another assassination mission. Oh my god! Where did you come from? I guess maybe you came from uh, the outpost. I don't know. Or maybe you were like one of those guys who were with the convoy. Uh, I don't know. But while that shotgun had a surprising amount of range, it took the guy out. I guess I am shooting both barrels at at once. Uh, it does that by default, and you can't you can't change it. Um, so yeah, I, I guess I'm sh I am shooting quite a lot of shells at once uh, towards the guy. So maybe that has something to do with it. I don't know. Well, I haven't gone upwards yet, so maybe if I just head upwards um, into the right, um, there'll be some diamonds there, hopefully. Purely on the basis that I it's unexplored territory. Jeez. Yeah, I'm starting to regret not getting that briefcase. Um, at uh, the last safe house I was at, so yeah. Still, am I on the right way? Yeah, there we go. Let's see. So, yeah, we can ignore that, I think. Um, hopefully, there's not one too far from the gun store. I want to do this fast, and I want to start doing the story missions already. I'll sort of drive off like, a little bit like this. This open plane makes me think uh, there's something hidden here. Otherwise, I don't know why it would be here. Um, other than, you know, just having it be cool. No, I think this area is like, you come here, I think, at the end of one of um, the story missions, um, if you decide to help out your buddy. Like, he, you know, at the end of uh, story missions where you decide to take your buddy's um, advice, Usually, at the end of those missions, you have to bail your your buddy out. And oh yeah, there's a diamond, there's a briefcase here. I don't know how much, but yeah, we'll check this place out. And yeah, that's the place where he's um, where you have to help him out at the end of the mission. It's actually this particular mission that you where you have to go here, I think. Um, yeah, the uh, Occidental Growers Company is that how you say it? Should I go up there? Maybe not. Cause I gotta snipe these guys over here. This guy right there. I don't think still a bit jarring for me. The thing is, if I go up there, I have zero cover. Um, but the farther the back I go, the better because I have, you know, sniper rifle, right? Uh, let's see. Ah, uh, but there's not a lot of grass here either, so it's not. I'm not exactly gonna be camouflaged. I can go over by that tree, but that building over here is gonna block a lot of what I can see. If I do that, but it is the safer thing to do, so we'll yeah maybe we'll do this. There is a, there's a, quite a lot of dudes here, but there is a moment where like a lot of them are bunched up right in the middle, and uh, if you're, yeah if you're lucky, and so you can just pop a grenade right in the middle, 
and you're good to go. Oh yeah, I did practice with the mouse a little bit. I find aiming with the sniper rifle easier with the mouse, I think, so we'll try that. I see no one else, though, except the guy over here. Oh, you son of a... Alright, he's helping out his buddy. Let's shoot him. Got him. Nope, I got his buddy. Dang it. There we go. Alright, uh, what else? What else? Who's next? Oh, there we go. Oh, wow, okay. Might have to adjust the sensitivity on this. I got him. Uh, it's, yeah, it might have to lower the sensitivity specifically. Is anyone coming? Oh, look at that sunset, though. Look at that. It's nice. Might have to pull that for a screenshot there. Anyone home? I hear the grass, uh... Swaying, I guess? Okay, no. Yeah, I, I thought I heard someone, like, running through the grass, but it was just the wind coming through, uh... Coming through the grass there. I hear a car, though. Ah, here we go. It's over there. Yeah, let's get closer. Oh, it's time to show off the shotgun. God, this thing looks so cool. Uh, it's time to go Mad Max on these guys. See, there's no battle music, but, uh... I'm sure there's more dudes here. I'm sure of it. Let's see, I took out three dudes, so... I'm thinking there's two more left, if it's anything like the console... ...version... ...of this game. Why am I talking? Like this. Oh! God, you scared me! I guess that's four, I think... ...there's one more, we'll see. I hear something, hang on. I should really have both of my, uh... ...sides of my headphones on, I only had one side. Missed! Oh, I, I hit him a little bit, but... Shot at the wall! Come on, you can't do that. Alright, let's go on this one. Where is he? Oh! Ah, Got him! Are you still up? Get back down. Nice! Alright. Oh, who's shooting me? Uh, which side does it come from, specifically? Hang on. Stupid tree. <laughs> wow, okay. Um, what's your gun? It's gonna have to do... Pump action, alright. I think this is actually a pretty reliable weapon, so even if it's, like, rusty, you're pretty, um, you're pretty safe. I thought I heard a car there, but I don't see anything. That's my car over there, I believe, right? Hopefully. Anyway. Okay, good. Lots well, of been eight minutes. Ay, ay, ay. Alright, Diamond is somewhere up here, I think, so... Let's look around. Ah, right there, okay. Let's see. Hoo! Come on! There we go. Okay, I'm short one diamond. I was hoping for a three fur, but you know, can't get too greedy. Oh, I haven't uh, scattered this place out yet. Hang on, it's probably um fuel tanks, right? There we go. All right, so where else can I go? You're almost guaranteed a diamond if you go to like those enemy um. I don't know. You would call it uh like that area there, the Occidental Growers Company. That's sort of like um. I, I guess they call it a stronghold, if anything, to use more. General game term. It's, it's basically a place with a ton of enemies, but you're almost guaranteed to find some diamonds over there, so... <sighs> Probably gonna get to a huge fight if I do this. It's also a very difficult area to fight in. So I'm a bit concerned about that. I th oh, no, I think I remember now. The briefcase is, like, smack in the middle, so... I... Ew, I'm... Mm. Yeah, we're not we're not doing that now. It's a it's a suicide mission. It's also an actual story mission, so it's gonna suck when I have to do that. At the very least, I want my stealth pistol ready for that one. All right, so I'm trying to remember where the other diamonds were. I can't remember. I'm gonna have to just wander around probably. Hmm. 
I mean, I guess I could just head towards Paula for now, and maybe I'll run into uh, some diamonds. You know, we'll take the river. Um, so yeah, up on the top part of the map, I th there's a river there. I think that I can find some diamonds if I just take that river. And I get to use the boat, so that's always fun. Do I want the assault rifle? I kind of do. It's, I, I don't have anything with range, so... Yep, I probably should not have picked up that ammo box. For the shotgun, oh well. Alright. So yeah, we'll get to the river from the, um, the east side there. I guess I can unlock the safe house while I'm at it, yeah, we'll do that. It's like right next to there. God, I love playing this game. This is, yeah, I, I mentioned it before, it's probably a better game to stream because... It's not a lot that goes on with these episodes. It's like, you do one little thing, one episode, you do another little thing the next episode, then another little thing the next episode, then hopefully a story mission in the next episode. Alright, so... Yeah, I'm not well equipped for this next, uh, safe house. To take it out, at least. Oh well, we'll see what we can do. Don't turn around. Please don't turn- hang on. Which way is he facing? Okay, now he's facing the other way. Okay. Where's the other guy? So there's the one guy there and... Oh well. Don't look at me! Got him! God, this gun is great. Right, it's a safer, real quick. Um, should I? You know, I'll, I'll, I'll stay overnight. Do some RPing over here. It is, um, there is an advantage to playing at night, which is, you know, you're more stealthy. I don't know how that works, though. There's no, like, you don't, you don't get any hard numbers with how stealth works in this game, unfortunately. Well, no, I, I kind of like that you don't get the numbers as well. It makes it a bit more immersive, I guess. If you don't have, like, a bunch of, like, stats and numbers to look at. But I can't help but be a little interested, to be honest. I am definitely curious about how it works, but yeah. The downside is that it can be a little harder to see enemies and stuff. And you can't, see, you know, admire the game's gorgeous lighting, so... If you're into the lighting, as I am. You have an AK, sir, I'm taking it. It's a lot more, um, reliable, I believe, actually. Hang on, I can check. Upgrades. Okay, reliability is really high, yeah. It's almost perfect, in fact. Or maxed out, in terms of reliability. Anyway. Also, it's just a classic gun, you know? I don't even know when this gun was made, the AK. I think the guy who made it won some kind of medal or award. Like, uh, later in his life. Well, after making it, but yeah, it was, um, it was like a Russian guy, I think, right? Actually, what's the difference between an AK and a Kalashnikov? I, I, don't, I don't even know. They look the same to me. I think. Have I seen a Klish, Kalashnikov before? Are they the same thing? I don't know. There's no boat here, though, so I, I might have to swim, actually. This isn't good. I don't want to swim. There is a watering hole, actually, up ahead. Maybe I can, there's a boat there. Yeah, so it's such a slow-paced game. <laughs> Which I like, but again, I don't know. It doesn't exactly make it great for videos. But it's so much fun that I I can't, uh... I can't not help but do it. And it's also, like, one of my favorite games. Um... Like, if I had to have, like, um... Uh, oh, no, up ahead is, uh... It's an outpost. This is actually gonna be a bit tricky. There is a diamond at that outpost. <laughs> Screw it, we'll do it, we'll do it. It's a tough outpost, though. There's a ton of dudes, um, it's big... ...as well, so... Screw it, we gotta do it, we gotta do it. I think the diamond is... the briefcase is in there, so... Okay. We'll, g we'll get in, and we'll get out fast. That's how we'll do it. Hopefully. Ostensibly. Alright, let's do this. Don't like to stand, uh, sit up straight when I do these videos. I was all like crouched. And, not crouched, but hunched over. 
Got him. Go, go, go. No, you're not under attack. Who's shooting that pistol? Oh, God. Auto aim, help me. There we go. Alright, auto aim totally saved me there. Can I get these guys? Reach, please. Don't hit that rock. There we go. It didn't hit the rock, but it did hit the non-grassy part, the small bit of non-grassy part that exists there. That's not great. Alright, hopefully that'll distract them for a bit while I sneak in here. I should probably take this, actually. Oh, perfect. Anyway, where is that briefcase? There it is. Boosh! Alright. Let's get out of here. I don't know if they can cross the river, though, so... Maybe I didn't have to worry too much about, uh... Throwing that Molotov. Oh, well. Is this gonna be the whole video, just me getting diamonds to unlock, uh, the silent pistol? Probably. Oh well. Maybe I should just call this, like, an off-camera video and... ...release it separately, I don't know. Or release it alongside, um... ...like a major mission video, who knows. Is there a faster way to... You know, I can just fast- you know, I'll, yeah, I'll just fast travel to... ...um... Paula. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then uh, get the mission. And then, you know, um. After I get the, like, a story mission, then I'll go down to the gun shop and buy the sound pistol. There we go. Let's be smart about this. Hopefully, the enemies aren't chasing me down yet, no. Actually, I think there might be a diamond coming up, if uh, I'm not mistaken. Yeah, maybe not, actually. Especially with the route that I'm taking. Time for some off-roading! I wonder how vehicles actually handle in the sand. I've never, you know, driven on the sand before. I've never driven before, either, so that's another thing. I've had dreams where I've driven cars, and... Like, apparently, I'm dr the roads are made out of ice because I'm slipping over all over the place. It's, it's really weird. Let's see. There we go. Nope. There we go. Actually, hang on. Okay, no diamonds here. And we're here. Alright. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Oh, my throat, yeah. I, I probably shouldn't be drinking soda. I should just be drinking water, honestly. I remember, um, I listened to this podcast, um, about voice acting. I'm not interested in voice uh, getting into voice acting, I just listen to it just because uh, I have a lot for time. <laughs> and I just like listening to it, it's just fun, I don't know. It's just interesting to learn about. But yeah, like, one of the tips from the voice, the, the host who's a voice actor, said, he said, um, when you ha um, when you have to do some voice acting, you know, when you wake up, don't drink any, like, you know, I think, don't drink anything except water, just drink, just pure water, that's it. Just drink water. Um, let's see, because I guess anything else will sort of like, maybe cause some block up in your throat or something. Like I, you know, I, I imagine if you drink like dairy, like milk, uh, that'll cause mucus to form. Uh, hello, how's it going? What is it going great for missionaries these days? We fight for the FLN. You'll call me Doctor Kakumba. How you get across? Ah, you're good, Kumba. Nobody can come into country these days. Tell him. There is a special forces outfit in area, just gun for hired guys, but they are armed to the teeth. They are paid to right, right. shoot in and grab someone. He doesn't need to know. It's okay if he knows. They are here for a big shot from the APR, but if they take our enemy, we will fight. Just get to the point. The SF team is set up in good position in the desert, two kilometers to southeast. That's weird. Okay. So want anybody to think you know, just give me, just, just give me the thing. Come on, I don't have to listen to this. It's really not important to know, know any of this, really. Is in southern desert. Find the team and destroy their gear. Then they are nice I, I enjoy the, you know, the detail that went into it, though. And it's a little bit more don't listenable than something like... Um, oh, it's 15 diamonds is what I get, okay. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Then some of the stuff in, like, uh... 
I, I don't want to name it anything else. Anyway, yeah, that's gonna be it for now, I guess. Next time we'll be doing a mi that mission for, uh, um, what's his face? Gakumba. Well, we'll be going out to the desert. I guess that's, I think it's Oasis, yeah. Anyway, see you folks, bye.